to another quick tip here with Inspector911.com. We're just going to make a quick update to one of our video casts as it relates to how to get to the free NFPA code documents. This has to be one of the most searched items that we receive and it's a great resource that the National Fire Protection Association gives. Um, it allows access in a read-only format. Obviously the best way for you to view NFPA documents is to buy them or download and become a member of the uh, NFPA codes online and you can have access all the time. So what we're going to do here is we're going to go over to NFPA's webpage that's located at NFPA.org and this is the home page and there's lots of great things here but you know step one is really you follow this codes and standards button and if you just click on that the new page opens up and here on the left hand column is the list of NFPA codes and standards and as you can see we have a list of all the various documents um, let's just say we wanted to look up uh, the LPG code so NFPA 58 we just click on the link here and, and, and it's going to load now I've already done some back-end things in the background I've logged into my account and again but this is the free stuff so it's not my account for the NFPA codes online and here we can see the scope of the document, uh, the current document information, the next edition, who's on the technical committee, what edition to display, and if you just kind of click on here, you could have 08, 04, 01, and 1998. Down here on the bottom, well, first we've got the tentative interim agreements, the TIAs, formal interps, and then we've got view 2008 editions online. Now, I've already done some background work. Oh, it's going to make me re-log in here, which is okay. Quickly log in and hopefully we get now it gets to this online access that says hey you've got to agree to the uh, access so I'm gonna hit agree real quick and here we go open NFPA now you're gonna see a couple things come in first I'm gonna get this real read is going to start to open and then secondly and I'm gonna adjust the screen size just a little bit here so everybody can see um, but now we can get into and see the document and it reads slightly like a book alright I think I got it adjusted for everybody here on the screen so it's going to read like a book and if I just click on the, the right hand side it's going to flip like a book over here you'll see a little button for table of contents there's next and last and previous so let's go to the table of contents and you'll see a new page opens up so if I need to go check out a definition real quick, this gives me that faster access to where I need to go into the document. That way you don't have to flip every page. Um, so here we are. I, I get on Chapter 3 and I can scroll through. Now the thing here is we can't print. You can't copy it. But it's a great access that NFPA allows for you. There's one other quick way that I like to use, and this is just standard Google. Um, and if you just put in NFPA, let's go 90A. And NFPA has done a great job about optimizing their web page to get their hits up right near the top. So right here I could click on NFPA 90A. And again, look, I'm right at that standard screen. I didn't have to go through a lot of different sections and clicks just to get to it. Um, so that's our quick tip of the day. It's how to get free NFPA codes. Thanks to all the staff at the National Fire Protection Association for making that a little user friendly. And if you didn't know, you can always join Inspector 911 on Facebook. Our Facebook direct link is facebook.com forward slash does this meet code. So as always from your friends here at Inspector 911, thanks and make sure you sign up for our email list by putting your email address and we'll keep you up to date as lots of updates happen on the page every day. Have a great day, everyone.